I did a little rearranging of my my card room. Thought I'd give a little little bit of a tour. I have all kind of things laying around. My picture from Four Leaf Cards. Got an old pennant there. Some uncut sheets. There's an uncut sheet of 82 uh, Tops Baseball. Uncut sheet of Pittsburgh Pirates signature cards. The first baseball card magazine. Disc in the ad from Doc Gooden. You remember getting that ad? If you never saw it, that's what the disc looks like. My Bruce Lee. Marianne Motley. It's a signed picture of uh, Laura Baugh. Have my magazine from when I was in Sports Collector's Digest. Some Topps coins. Butterfinger. Old Steeler's pennant. Dr. J poster. Got all kind of cards laying around. My favorite gymnast. Got these wooden pictures. Got a Ty Cobb over there. Shoeless Joe Jackson. Over there I have a Big Ruth. Have the Honus Wagner. It's an old picture. I think those came from the stadium of Willie Stargell. That one's just in perfect condition. 1934 Quaker Oats Premium. Babe Ruth, and another Butterfinger, Dizzy Dean. Those are, I believe, from 1950. Gowdy Premium, Babe Ruth. Keep this upside down, but that's a Satchel Page, a Satchel Page autograph. Keep it out of the light, so I flip it over. That's a card my daughter made me for my birthday. My YouTube sports card Hall of Fame patch. Here I have a bunch of sweet capital pins and stuff like that. Uncut sheet of Roberto Clemente fan club cards. One of those record albums, I think from 64, Bill Bat Mazeroski. Um, I believe that's a 1949 All-Star pinup of Joe DiMaggio. Got my Terry Bradshaw signed jersey. Just put out some cards that I like and some displays. Keep some cards over here. I like to make displays like that. There's a pack with the gum. <laughs> Got a Dick Groat sign photo. Some uncut sheets of different types of cards. Got that cool Dodgers pinups. Still not open. They kind of remind me of the 1933 Gaudi when you open them up. Un unopened pack. Those uh, oversized tops cards. I think from 81, I believe. Got a sign, Nancy Lopez. An old license plate and some Steeler pins. From some championship teams. Got the proof there of the 78 Terry Bradshaw. I like to get these, uh, I got these, they're like magnet boards. I got for like six bucks at Walmart. And then I just put a little piece of magnet tape on the back of my top loaders and they make a nice display and very inexpensive. If you have raw cards, Japanese uncut sheet with uh, DiMaggio there in the corner. Victor Starfin, some good Japanese players as well. Topps Vault. Some of their football cards. That's a picture that features Jim Thorpe on a baseball team. You don't find those too often. Secretariat, my favorite athlete of all time. Piece of the saddle there. Babe Ruth. I 
I get these um, from Michaels. Uh, they have felt on the back, so what I'll do is I'll, I'll put the case um, in a, you know, a perfect fit sleeve or whatever, and then I get those wall hangers, and they're sticky on one side, and they have uh, Velcro on the other, and I just stick them in there. They make a nice display too. Honus Wagner. There's an old. Um, that's a ticket from the Lakers and Celtics back in the day. Bird versus Magic. Clemente there. Some RC Cola cans. Milk cartons. That's Luis Gonzalez. Some baseballs there. I got Mantle, Ryan, Duke Schneider, all those guys. Pete Rose bat. Man, I got that so long ago. When you hear... Uh, what you hear me kicking on the floor are boxes that are laying everywhere <laughs> on different sets. <laughs> Been organizing, so I have a lot of them out. Oh no, I just noticed one of my cards fell out. I taped them to the outside of the picture frame so that I wouldn't smash them. <laughs> well, I gotta go find that. I just did that. It's an old Rawlings um, stand usual. That thing's pretty awesome. Some more cards. Willie Randolph with my pirates. Rare signed photo with him in a pirate's uniform. A, that's a seat from Three Rivers Stadium. My cousin got it for me when they uh, imploded the stadium and they were uh, they, they sold off the, the seats. And uh, there's a piece of the turf, too, I have under there. One of those old helmets. I got little mini bats of Clemente, Johnny Bench, DiMaggio, Mantle. Um, they were stadium giveaways during the time. And I have some game used and signed bats here. Dave Parker, Richie Hebner. Bill Robinson, um, who am I missing? Bill Madlock, got Al Oliver there. And I have the bat that I believe Johnny Ray is using in that card. It's also shown in his rookie card, but that was his game used bat. And of course, Willie Stargell, Omar Marino, the Antelope. This is a game used signed hat by Gary Templeton, Boo Powell, Eric Davis, Al Oliver. And this is signed by Ralph Branca and Bobby Thompson. Got Antonio Brown signed helmet there. I like that a lot better before. I got <laughs> I got um, some of those old sports card lockers. Press photo of Hack Wilson there. Bunch of my different hats you see me wearing. Got cards everywhere. This is where I film, but I also uh, do a little organizing here. I have another table over there that I've loaded up. And uh, over there I have my light and my magnifying glass. And I keep supplies, and that's where... When I get my packages or new cards, I'll, I'll sit there and um, put them in sleeves or whatever. Let's walk around here. I got albums here. This is only a small fraction of my collection. Honestly, I have things everywhere else. Some of those old posters, Oscar Robinson. Oscar Robertson, um, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Uncut sheet of those. Not too easy to find. I was a big fan of hers. Got some starting lineups. So, this is what my, my card room's looking like. Here's another big mess of them.